Welcome to How to Care for Your Mental Health, a project brought to you by CT Kids as Self Advocates, also known as CT Casa, and National Youth as Self Advocates, also known as YASA. The COVID 19 pandemic has forced us all to stay at home and social distance. This means many of us who rely on our friends, family, and community for support have felt a negative impact on our mental health. Feelings of sadness and isolation are felt even harder by those who already had depression and other mental health conditions. In this video, my friend Andy and I want to share some tips and advice on caring for your mental health in a positive way. We will also share some personal stories of the youth and young adults in CT Casa and Yasa. Andy, how about you begin by sharing some tips and advice? Sure, Emily. Staying home for long periods of time can be hard. There are things you can do to stay well and be happy. Ask yourself, how am I doing? Keep appointments with therapists and doctors. Jake checks in with other people on social media. Luke loves having a daily routine. Emily plays with her new puppy. Victor spends time with his family. Andrea is taking a class and learning how to sew. Take a break from news and social media. Caitlin likes to exercise with her Zumba class. Give yourself a pep talk when you're feeling down. Read your favorite book or magazine. Play games to keep your brain sharp. Jake listens to music and videos with upbeat messages. Victoria creates new art. Arif reads positive quotes to keep a positive outlook. Jake follows a well-balanced diet. Thank you, Andy. That was very helpful and informative. Now, before we conclude this video, I want to share some of the unique ways the youth from CT Casa and Yasa are caring for their mental health. Luke, Ayanda, and Arif are continuing to learn through their remote high school and college classes. Jake, Sammy, and Luke like to stay active by going outside. Luke likes to go on walks in his neighborhood. Sammy enjoys walking her dogs, and Jake has been taking horseback riding lessons. Victoria and Arif have found music to be helpful. Victoria plays piano and Arif listens to his favorite music. Ayanda takes time to read new books. Sammy finds pleasure in making bracelets. Wednesday and Jake enjoy keeping touch with their friends through social media and organizing online game nights. And Arif attends counseling sessions on a weekly basis via telehealth. Thank you to Path CT and Family Voices, along with the members of CT Casa and Yaza, for helping us better care for our mental health. Check out our other video brought to you by CT Casa and Yaza on understanding telehealth. To learn more about Path CT, visit pathct.org. To learn more about Family Voices and Yaza, visit familyvoices.org/yaza. Thank you.